Hello, my producers, and welcome down to Tuesday. Well, I think it'll be a partly sunny day, very pensive again. In the last 24 hours, Taurus, the moon conjuncted Mars, a retrograde Mars, which is in the house of thinking and communication. That's probably calling for Tauruses to go back and have conversations with people for a second time, to think through something important a second time, to evaluate your processes a second time, third or fourth time. I always have a joke with Tauruses, they keep doing it thoroughly until they finally get every little clue of their mistake. So Mars retrograde means that you'll definitely be doing something over again with communication or processing or looking at how you talk to yourself too again. Now in the last 24 hours, the moon conjuncting in Mars, Mar 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 Mars retrograde, that's ironic because I'm a Taurus and Mars retrograde in my house thinking, communicating. Because Mars is in retrograde and the moon has struck it, that means emotionally you might get charged or fed up in this capacity. But today, no matter what happened in the last 24, the moon is definitely calling to a potential healing, most likely due to a conversation, likely with a partnership marriage or otherwise. That's because the moon will strike a soul pyramid in the next 24 hours. And so this processing you're doing, probably related to the Mars conjunction, maybe not, is gonna go forward into a long-term relationship represented by Mercury and Scorpio, and then over to Uranus in the house of friends and society. That means there's a potential for a maturing today, emotionally, especially if you get something off your chest, likely with an LTR, and likely by the end of this, you'll find that your position in society, your attitude to society, shifts just a little bit. Uranus is leading you there. You don't necessarily know where you're going. Now on the conscious growth of the month, the sun in Sagittarius makes the whole month a bit partly cloudy for Tauruses anyway. That's because when the sun is in Sagittarius, well, that's so ironic. When the sun is in Sagittarius, you are developing your uh, issues with intimacy and trust and really getting to the core of your trust issues. All right, so today, Mercury is kind of aiding that process as well. Would not be too surprised that of the long-term relationship of romance versus partnership otherwise, it'll probably be romance you have the discussion with because it's tied into that intimacy issue. All right, Bull, that's all we have for Tuesday. See you tomorrow with more. Live, love, be. So garden. Dot.